We move on to the other news. An author, Salman Rushdie, attacked on stage in western New York today, a man stabbing him repeatedly before being tackled by police. Rushdie, the target of death threats for decades, then airlifted to the hospital. News coming in tonight on his condition and what played out in front of those in horror who were sitting there in the audience. Here's ABC's Mola Lenghi tonight. Tonight, Salman Rushdie is in the hospital and a man is in custody. The famed author airlifted after a brazen attack. With the amphitheater, the presenter was just attacked on the stage on EDMF. Authorities say the man seen here attacked the author as he was about to give a lecture at the Chautauqua Institution. The suspect has been identified as Haiti Matar, age 24, from Fairview, New Jersey. The Chautauqua Institution, a nonprofit education center about an hour outside of Buffalo. It's a place of study and reflection and religious uh, inquisitiveness, and it's now a crime scene. Joshua Goodman with the Associated Press witnessed the attack. He had just walked onto the stage and a man uh, rushed from this audience up onto the stage uh, and started punching or stabbing. It wasn't quite clear. Another witness, Valerie Haskell. He actually went at him at least 10 to 15 times. Photos of the aftermath showing blood spatter on a wall and a chair and rescuers lifting Rushdie's legs in the air. Rushdie's agent telling ABC News the nerves in his arm were severed, his liver was stabbed, and he'll likely lose an eye. New York's governor, Kathy Hochul, praising the quick police response. He is alive. He has uh, been transported, airlifted to safety. But uh, here's an individual who has uh, spent decades uh, speaking truth to power. Rushdie has spent decades looking over his shoulder. His 1988 book, The Satanic Verses, is considered by many Muslims to be insulting to Islam. After it was published, Iran's supreme leader, Ayatollah Khomeini, issuing a fatwa, calling for Rushdie to be killed. One religious group reportedly promising a bounty of more than $3 million. Salman Rushdie. Tonight in Iran, they're reporting on the attack. After years in hiding, Rushdie had been living comfortably in New York City before the attack. Uh, right now, law enforcement officials are searching a location in New Jersey linked to the suspect. The FBI is involved in that search. No word yet on a possible motive tonight. Now, given Rushdie's history, extra security was requested for the event here, and two police officers were present, David. The investigation stretching from New Jersey to right there in western New York tonight. And Mola, we thank you.